Let's simulate the resource allocation of PDCCH in the time and frequency domain. So this is the same example we have considered earlier. We are taking a test model of 1.1. We are taking a bandwidth of 5 MHz with the FTD duplex mode. Here we are showing one subframe. So the PDCCH allocated here are depicted in the yellow color. And this is here in the OFTM symbol 0. Now, if we go back to the specification derived by 3GPP, what we can see is if we have 5 MHz with the test model 1.1, what the number of PDCCH we are going to allocate it. And this is further defined by the PCFICH. We understood how many symbols to be defined for the PDCCH. So we have only one symbol here in this case of 5 MHz. Now, if we look into the resource allocation for the PDCCH, what we see normally here is it depends upon the number of CCEs that are going to allocate for PDCCH. So how many CCE that are allocated here? Those are two. And how many REG resource element group we have per CCE? Those are standard, that is nine. And when we multiply this REG with the number of CCE and the number of PDCCH, what we get is the total resource element group that is being allocated for the PDCCH. So total 36 REG is going to allocate for the PDCCH or for the control channel. Now, these are 36 REG is the group of resource element, but what in terms of resource element it would be, that is multiplied by four. So it would be 144 resource elements within the resource grid would be allocated to the PDCCH. If we come back here, what we see is there is a, there are 300 subcarriers here in the OFTM symbol zero. What we have is we have 300 different resource elements here present. And if you broadly see, it is tough to, tough, to, tough to visualize, but you can broadly get an idea that around 150, half of this is being allocated to the PDCCH. So this is a broader idea, like 144 resource elements are being allocated to the PDCCH in the OFTM symbol zero. And it will vary. It depends if we consider the different channel bandwidth, say, for example, 1.4 megahertz. In that case, what is we are seeing is the number of resource element group allocated to the PDCCH required is less. And if we simulate that, we can just take uh, 1.4 megahertz and one subframe in that case, and we just visualize it. What we get is we have the PDCCH allocated in that case is around 72. And we can visualize it from these two OFTM symbol. And these OFTM symbols allocated to the PDCCH is derived from PCFICH, we have two FTM symbol here, whereas in case of five, it was only one. In that case, we are getting 18 REG, it means 72 resource elements. So we can see approximately 72 resource elements are spreading across these OFTM symbol zero and OFTM symbol one. So this is broadly how the resources are getting allocated.